Hi there folks, this is Randy and you're in the Tramps World Motorsports Channel. And it's a beautiful Sunday morning. We're in Lake Havasu City, Arizona. And we're at the Lake Havasu Museum of History. You can see it right there. This is an annual car cruise put on by Crash Customs. The local hot rod shop. And we come down here and we thought we'd walk along and we'd show you some of the beautiful cars that show up in Lake Havasu City on any given Sunday. Yesterday we were Rat City Ruckus in Las Vegas, looking at rat rods. Today we're looking at hot rods in Lake Havasu. So don't forget to uh, like and comment and share. Tell me which car you like the best. Boy, that's a beautiful wagon, isn't it? Man, that is, that is a beauty. And there's one for your last ride. Hey, check this out. This hurts. Got like, oh man. And your driver today. So yeah, we're gonna walk along, play a little music, have a little fun, look at all these beautiful cars. It's been car show heaven the last several weeks, last month. Beautiful panel. You can see some of the nice cars that we're going to go look at. Nice, beautiful, restored Camaro. Oh man, look at this Econoline. Wow, now that is really cool. That is really cool. What does it look like inside? Oh my goodness. Check that out. How would you like to ride around in that? Beautiful truck. So we're in the shopping center, right down by the London Bridge. You can see Gear Up Motorsports in the background there. Premier motorcycle dealership for used motorcycles and service and all that good stuff. Bring your bike down and get it worked on, buy a bike. A lot of cars here on this small local show. So this morning we were actually headed over to the mini truck show to have a suit meltdown. I didn't realize that they didn't have it on Sunday because Saturday I was in Las Vegas, of course, in Rat City Ruckus. Oh, nice, nice race car. There's a real art to putting these stickers in the right place, these decals. Drive that every day. So why don't we check out this nice Nomad over here. Nice 57 Nomad. And the local famous death trap, Cadillac hearse. 
uh, guy has a lot of fun with this ride. Your brass pink on the back. Really loud, really nasty. All right, guys, leaving. You must have something to do. So we'll spin it around, we'll go check out another row of cars. Oh, look at this Dodge van. That is so cool. Look how nice it is. I would drive that in a heartbeat. Porsches are leaving, they must have a Porsche thing, probably a fancy breakfast somewhere. Oh, I'm gonna get ran over by a minivan. <laughs> All right, here we go. Nice pickup truck. Ah, oh, poor Chucky. Oh man, I'm gonna get ran over by another minivan. This is crazy. Minivans everywhere, driving right through a car shop. I don't really need it. It's pretty good car. I'm going back. Okay, we'll talk to you later. I'm glad you got it out. Are you coming? This old pickup truck. All right, so we got here. It must be like 9.30 or something. These guys are like, <laughs> they're starting to leave. So what do they do? Get here at daybreak or something. <laughs> they get here at daybreak and show off their cars and then eat all the donuts and then take off to do their Sunday thing. Nice dudes. This Camaro's got just amazing paint. We shot him many times before. Quarters get a little tight there. It's a little hard to walk around. Don't want to bump, bump into it and all that stuff. Saw this, saw this Bonneville, um, over at the Crossroads car show. An amazing car. Now we saw something that was really unusual. Was, see the back, the back window and that back trim piece and that vent? It's really cool, very unusual. Beautiful interior. All right, we'll scamper around here, try to dodge some people. Here we go. And Don brought his van here. He's got the side open up. Oh, check this out. So, you know, they put the motor in the front. Well, not Don. He's got the motor right there. You put that big old giant motor inside your van. Kind of cuts down on the room for the bed and the, the bar and all that stuff, but. I got out like four times, checked in my corner. <laughs> it's a bitchin' van, I love it. So rare to see these without a big blower motor sticking out of them. Beautiful red 55. Attention to detail, look at the motor. Everything is clean inside the engine compartment. 
Everything is just right. Another one, engine compartment, perfectly clean. Attention to detail, beautiful. Beautiful interior. Again, they're parked a little bit close, so it's kind of hard for me to get in there. Oh, we just saw that a moment ago. I guess he's got somewhere to go. Probably got a six cylinder in it. <laughs> Beautiful green Firebird. What do you think, 68? So it's a 68, right? 68? Yeah. I'm Deb, in the Army. Hello? What? Yo, my brother seven. When he was in the Army. Had a 326 and a four-speed in it. Yeah, they have the vent windows in 67. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yep, it was bare it was bare bones. Yeah. White vinyl roof, gold body. Yeah. You know, no AC, no, you know, but but he ended up building the motor and it was fast. <laughs> he loves it. Of course, 50 years later, it's like, man, I should have kept that car. <laughs> Mike Barton's beautiful 32. Check this out. Perfect car. Good morning, Mr. Mike. Hey, so, uh, somebody's birthday? Your wife's birthday? Not my birthday. I don't have Oh, happy birthday. Thank you. Congratulations on knocking down another one. 75. <laughs> nice being 60, right? Mike's a beautiful car. Look at that. Really cool dude. I like to call him the Godfather because he reminds me of the Godfather. And of course we dodge around the little dog. Now I'm saying this is a 58 Corvette. Correct me if I'm wrong, put a comment down below. Say if you're wrong or you're right. Boy, in the last couple of weeks we've seen quite a few. 56, 57, 58 Corvettes. Man, that is nice. Look at the dashboard. Got a grab rail on there. <laughs> so if you get on it real hard, you grab the grab rail thing on the dashboard. Really kind of nice to walk around a car show without having some uh, music blaring me. Man, I was at Rat City Ruckus yesterday and boy, that music was loud. But it was fun. Where do we see those videos? Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification button. Keep an eye on the Tramps World Motorsports channel. And we have hot rod helicopters. Lake Havasu Museum of History, a gyroplane. A gyroplane, how about that? Man, I don't like flying at all. You couldn't get me up in that at all, ever. So let's squeeze our way through and try to look. <laughs> Look at the checkerboard thing, or the checkered flag thing, I should say. Watch out. We're going to squeeze between these cars. Right 
right, so it's the middle of April. Sunday morning here, it's gonna be about 77 degrees. Perfect weather, getting ready to head on up into the 80s. What's it like where you live? And next week in the Tramps World, we start getting into boats. We have the boat show, we have Super Cat Fest, we have Desert Storm coming up in a couple of weeks. All about the boats and the London Bridge and the channel and the lake. But we still got some cars to go here. You should take up two spaces. You deserve it. I'll park, park that car in there nice and crooked and take up two places. That's beautiful dudes there. So if you look back into the library a little bit, you'll find the um, Habsu Deuce days. Got about five videos of the deuces. Man, they were beautiful. So you can see we're kind of squeezing through these quarters here. I can squeeze it around there, get a look at these cars. It's like a 49 or a 50 Ford. What do you think? <laughs> you got dice on the, on the mirror. So I believe this is a, oh man, I have to look at a past video. It's a, like a 1925, Wizard or something like that. I'm sorry, it's a Whippet. 1925 Whippet. Not many of those around, I don't think. I didn't even know what it was a long time. Another nice 55. I like the way this one sets. He sits pretty low. Got those really cool wheels on there. I think this may be a 64. Again, throw me a comment down below. Tell me if I'm wrong or right. Call it out for me. Tell me what your favorite car is. My favorite car is the one that got away, or the two that got away, or the 12 that got away. Here's the back end of that van with the V8, mid-van V8, mid-engine. So it had a few deuces, this uh, pink lady car was for sale. I don't know if it got sold or whatever, but it's pink, it's a whole lot of pink. So if somebody bought it, they would have to really like pink. Do a lot of backward shooting or dodging these chairs. Keep backing up, we'll grab another 55 Chevy. That was my first car, 55 Chevy. Two door with a little 283 and a Muncie 4-speed. Chrome reverse wheels, American Mags in the front. Primer spots on it. Had a push bar bumper that I made in metal shop. A lot of these cars you can see at my Crossroads Hot Rod video, Crossroads Car Show. 
at the 95 Speedway. Oh man, look at this, look at this pickup truck. Okay, we're gonna take a squeeze around here. We're gonna go in between two pickup trucks and get to the other side. We'll get you there. For you Chevy truck fans, I know there's one guy that commented from Thailand. He liked these 3100 pickup trucks that he saw in one of my videos. Here's the back end of that, that, that Ford. Nice Ford Sunliner convertible. Look at that dashboard. Nice two-tone, nice gauges. It's got air conditioning under the dash. If you're in Arizona, you should probably have air conditioning. All right, beautiful car. All right, let's wind our way through here. Scamper up to the front. Nice 56 panel. There's the hearse. There's a beautiful park with the station wagon right there. It's the Crash Custom Cars. They're personal vehicles. I'll bet it runs perfect. And this is Mrs. Crash's Mustang project. So you might check them out on YouTube. And you can see progress on that Mustang right there. It's Crash Customs. That's the museum entrance. Now, if you look at last year's video, I actually walked through there. I won't do it to, to you again. So they do upholstery stitching and they've got clothing. They've got their hats. Hey, Mr. Crash. What's happening, man? What's man, up? oh, I made it back from Las Vegas yesterday. Spent the day at Rap City Ruckus. Oh, was that good? Nice. Yeah, it was great. It's awesome. I love it. And I was going to uh, have a few meltdown. I didn't realize they were gone on Sunday. Oh, yeah. Yeah, ended, yeah, yeah no, no mini trucks. Really, you didn't get that much. It was really, uh, really small show. Yeah, uh, yeah. Bye. Yeah. Good seeing you. So the, uh, on the Mustang, um, who painted over the Mustang badge on it? Is it Earl Scheib? <laughs> yeah. You know Earl Scheib is, right? Mr. Mr. Earl. Right. <laughs> Any car, 59.95. We'll yeah, yeah. We paint everything. He would. Just everything. Would. You want the jams <laughs> painted, you're getting the seats painted too. There you go. <laughs> All right. So, shot and go. so thanks a lot for putting on the show. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Gave me something to do on a Sunday morning. I think yeah. it's good. I think it's good for the community. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We'll see you later, man. See ya. Lake Havasu City in particular, we have so many hot rods that I can show you every single week. We've got a lot of great boats too. We got a lot of boat stuff coming up. Boat shows. A great lineup of cars on a small local show. Oh, nice Camaro. 